welcome to Junk Drawer Magic, where we teach you how to create wonders with things you can find in your junk drawer. What are you making? I thought people might want their very own Junk Drawer Magic deck of cards, so I thought I'd send them a couple empty boxes. Where are the cards? You don't need any. If you fold the box in a specific way, the box makes its own cards. What? How? I'll show you. I'm just gonna fold the box here. That. Up, down, and... Wait, now we have to shake the box three and a half times. One, two, three, half. What? The box really works? No, it's just a trick. We'll show you how to make it next. Ready to create your own magic card box? Kind of more excited to destroy the boxes. Let's go to the junk drawer. For this trick, we'll need two card boxes, scissors, and double-sided tape. To start, we're gonna take our first box apart so that it's one flat connected piece. Cut off the small side flaps. Next, we're gonna take our second box, cut off the same side flaps and the big top piece. Next, we're gonna tape our sealed box onto this main part of the flat box. The trick is you had the second box there the whole time. It was just hidden from the audience's view. Now it's time to do the trick. Hold the box so that the audience only sees one side. Quickly, fold the flaps around the hidden box. Then, dump the cards out like they magically appeared out of nowhere. Cool, my turn. Thanks for watching Junk Tour Magic. Hey Walker, I made my own magic box. Really? Does it make its own cards? Nah, it's not a card box. It's a human fingers box. Ew, that's nasty. Don't do that, Akira. Too late. One, two, three, half. Oh wow, the box made a ton of Skittles instead. Really? Nah, it made fingers. <laughs> so now, I'm gonna rip off a corner. The thing is, if I squeeze it. What? Wait a minute. There's something in the potato chip bag? No way. 